Kerala. A state on India's tropical Malabar coast has nearly 600 km of Arabian Sea shoreline. It is known for its palm-lined beaches and backwaters, a network of canals. Inland are the Western Ghats mountains whose slopes support tea, coffee and spices plantations as well as wildlife. Kerala, besides being known as one of the most beautiful places to visit in India, it is also Kerala's local cuisine that stands out for its various lip-smacking preparations. Full of flavor, it is hard to get over the spicy stir-fries and meat roast, nourishing curries, biryanis and the fluffy appams. Even some of the most simple dishes make an everlasting impression such as the avial, known to be the most loved comfort food among the locals. Today, we will try to discover the origin of this very simple dish, avial. Aviel is a creamy vegetarian curry with origins in the Kerala region, although it is equally popular in Tamil Nadu and Udipi. Aviel means to be cooked and it is made with curd and coconut milk along with a variety of seasonal vegetables. Aviel is an integral part of the Indian vegetarian feasts called Sadhya. Onam Sadhya or the Grand Vegetarian Feast of the Malayalis to celebrate the homecoming of the King Mahabali during the Harvest Festival has to include avial as one of the items of the 26th course meal. It was a beloved dish not just of the people but also the mighty kings who ruled the region during ancient times as per legend. In fact, it is believed that Avial was invented by Prince Bhim, one of the five Pandavas during their exile. There are numerous theories and stories about the origin of Avial, although the one related to Prince Bhim seems to be the most popular. According to Virat Parva, one of the 18th books of the Mahabharata, during the 13th year of their exile, the Pandavas lived in the kingdom of King Virat, in disguise to avoid being detected by the Kauravas. As per the terms of the exile, if the Pandavas were detected, they would be exiled again for another 12 years. To conceal their true identity, Yudhishthira took the role of a game entertainer to the king, Bhim as a cook called Ballav, Arjun as a unique dance and music teacher, Nakul as a caretaker of horses, Sahadev as a cowherd and Draupadi as a queen's maid. Bhim or Ballav under his new role started carrying out various tasks in the kitchen such as cleaning and chopping vegetables and helping in the preparation of the meals. One day, after everyone had finished their meal, an unexpected guest arrived at the palace. It was Rishi Durvasa, who was known for his ill temper and the habit of cursing if not offered the best hospitality. Bhim had the task of cooking up a delicious meal for the Rishi to avoid his rage, but there wasn't much food in the kitchen other than a handful of vegetables. With hardly having any time at hand, Bhim quickly got down to preparing a dish using whatever ingredients that were available in the kitchen and created avial. 
pleased with the meal and left the palace satisfied. The dish soon started being raved about, become hugely popular in no time. There are some, however, who do not support the story and instead give credit to the king of Travancore for instigating the idea of creating a wheel. It is said that a grand feast was held by the king for his people and everyone across the kingdom came for it. Soon, the kitchen was running out of food, miscalculating the huge turnout. When the king inspected the kitchen, he found that various parts of vegetables were wasted while chopping. He ordered his cook to collect those pieces and quickly make a curry to serve the people and thus a wheel was invented by his cook. Whatever may be the theory, food lovers are grateful that the novel idea struck someone and resulted in creating one of the most nourishing curries in India, which has the power to please one instantly with its simple flavors. I hope you have liked today's history. Share your thoughts and comments with me and don't forget to subscribe this channel. Beauty's Kitchen is also available on Facebook and Instagram. Follow Beauty's Kitchen over there. See you soon.